foyers on and it needs new batteries for the door uh, but inside's pretty dry so pretty happy with it overall the wheels are still looking pretty good and that wheels yeah a bit broken so we'll probably have to do that but if it rolls we're going to take it out and move it to the next field and put new batteries and see if it works i do have a youtube channel and i'll have to do a bit more on it um to get people to come to my courses <laughs> I should okay like a glove um yeah i designed the, the chicken house so it fit into the trailer and it fits in so here we go so we got it into um got it out of that field we rolled it out okay and back into the trailer and into the new field and my first job was to start repairing these wheels so the wheels and everything were fine but where they connected onto the box had become a bit loose so i just needed to um uh, use some galvanized band and such to to patch that up and straighten it all out uh, so it's up in blocks for that and that worked out pretty good uh, that's my friend's solar panel that he has for keeping the battery charged that we were running the electric fence on before so all that's fine the um the chicken guard door um i don't think it was just the batteries i think you had to sort something else out inside it so waiting for an update on that and the, the handle in front had to replace as well oh there's this beautiful plant that was growing in the new place um i think it's gonorrhea i think it's an invasive species like a giant fruit bar that looks really pretty have a job getting out of that. Oh, these are the um, the nesting boxes for laying eggs. There's a, a roll away tray there, so they can't pick at them. And younger viewers, some younger viewers might recognize this picture and this box from a different incarnation when it was a treasure box. And those are the two uh, nesting boxes taken out and these wonderful uh, roll away trays. So the idea here is that these are at a slant and when the chickens lay them, they roll in out of the way here because uh, sometimes chickens uh, peck eggs and break them. Okay, so this is looking inside after four years out in the rain and overall it's fine. Uh, there's like bits of moulds in the corner, uh, but not too bad overall. Um, so that ventilation I think was working pretty well. Now my friend did um, cover the roof to make this opaque and he's dead right because it would have been really hot the chickens in there in the summertime and maybe give them a sense of protection as well. So that's a little modification that he did. Um, but everything's working great, which is kind of amazing after four years. So I'm pretty happy with the uh, design overall. I hope he gets the, the door working. And this is a view from the front um, and I replaced the, the bar, the kind of toe bar with uh, a piece of willow growing nearby. Uh, so that's it, I think. You'll get chickens and get another four years at least out of this lovely mobile system. Uh, if you like this stuff, obviously, please uh, subscribe, like, comment, and better again, look at permaculturedesign.ie, which is my main uh, business website where there's a lot more details of what I get up to. Thank you. Bye.